ha, I need to process this whole thing. This was an experience. My very, very first K-pop concert ever. Like, it's going to be a core memory for life. Okay, you guys, so I am back home from the concert. I... Aha, I need to process this whole thing. This was an experience. My very, very first K-pop concert ever. It's going to be a core memory for life. Yeah, so this vlog was going to be like how my entire journey was. Before we get started, I want to remind you guys to like, to comment, and to subscribe, as well as turn on your notifications so that you will always know whenever I have a new video out. And also, you guys, don't forget, Every time you watch my vlogs, please, please, please make sure to share it on your social media. This is going to be a vlog about my very, very first K-pop experience, aka my TXT or my Tomorrow Buy Together concert experience. Okay, so you're going to see me dressed like this in a different vlog. I did not want to talk about this till I was 110% sure that it was going to happen. <laughs> I am so excited. This is going to be a first for me and it's going to be a super awesome experience. I'm watching TXT tomorrow! Day 2 of their concert and we got royalty tickets. And I did the whole thing. Like, I already got our queuing numbers. I registered our ticket because we're doing sound check tomorrow. So wish me luck. I've watched vlogs before of um, how it goes and apparently like it can get really really hot like things start at like 11 a.m at noon and stuff so yeah i'm looking forward to hopefully meeting a number of moas out there moas in moa <laughs> so the first concert is tonight and i'm really sad that i'm not going to be going to both nights <laughs> uh, my first k-pop concert experience is going to happen and i am ecstatic when you go and claim this from wherever you get a ticket like this one's from moa um, or from SM. Pulp was the one who was in charge of the um, Tomorrow Bite Together concert. Since I did the sound check, um, yeah, here. So you get a queuing number. So I was really, really far. It says 467. I was pretty far back. So what they make you do is they make you print this. So you go into a specific area where you get your lanyard, which is like, so here's mine. It says royalty. It comes with this lanyard. And then they're going to give you one of these. So it says here, royalty B. And then they put it on your wrist. Like I was able to slide it off of my hand, lucky me. And then they give you one of these cards as well. Sorry, I'm, I have the light one. Once you have all these, all these, like you can head out. Like I grabbed lunch after this and then at around two o'clock, because there actually really is a schedule for the queuing and stuff just so that like you don't get left behind and whatever. Yeah, from there you literally like you sneak through Moa Arena and then wherever number you are, that's how you get to your, to your final destination. AKA the royalty standing area there. Like that's that's how the whole ticketing thing works. TXT allows um, you to take photos and videos during soundcheck. But I do believe that there are other groups that um, don't allow it or there are other companies that don't allow you to take photos or videos during soundcheck but Pulp um, allows and yeah like here are a couple of clips oh okay so we just cl I just claimed my pass <gasps> here's more arena so we have to buy batteries for the light stick right. so I shall return Moa Okay, so after you get everything, you have to queue. Number's pretty far. Like, I even bumped into a friend who's like number 46. I'm 467. So you wait in line, and then depending on the queue number that you get, that's how soon you can go into the arena. We're literally about to go inside, so let's go.
right? So after the sound check, which was insane, <laughs> you have to wait for a little bit because it's only royalty sound check ticket holders that are able to enter the arena that early. So you're literally just playing a waiting game the entire time. Um, yeah, I got there at maybe at about 2, 2.30 and then sound checked at 5, 5.30 and then concert started at 7.30. Concert ended at quarter to 11. I was standing the entire time. Like my feet are in pain and I have a class tomorrow, but TXT, I love you guys. And that was probably one of the best concert experiences that I have ever gone through. And it was worth it. My feet are in pain. I have a class tomorrow. It's gonna suck for me, but it was all worth it all worth it so there's usually a guideline for what you can and cannot bring so i guess um it depends again on who is um, handling the concert i did not bring a professional camera what i brought my samsung <laughs> uh my z flip 4 that's just from the concert like so if you guys are wondering um like what did i bring to the concert so, so i brought my prada um bag and then so i had i have this phone um because i knew we were gonna be standing for a little bit fan it got really humid i had a roll um this is from lorene one of her like roll-on um essential oils so this is a tip i learned from going to shoots and stuff if you know you're going to be like really hot outside you get one of these cool fever patches and then you put it at the back of your neck. Hand sanitizer, of course. Wallet. And then my Kosas. Yeah, that's pretty much what I brought. And I was just like holding my hat the entire time. This is what I wore. So yeah, I had this Privé Alliance fuzzy bucket hat. This shirt that I literally, I think I got from like Taipei or like some place. I used my favorite bdg um high-waisted jeans because it's also loose so it was so easy to walk, um, move around um, i also wore this necklace that one of my writers janelle it says strong she gave me and then i'm just using like a bunch of like earrings that i got off of like random stores and stuff now let's move on forward to the things that i got at more arena and at the concert First, these, this headband with Yeonjun on it. So, I now have a Yeonjun fan of some sort. <laughs> and then this ribbon. I guess you can like tie it onto your um your moabong. Um, I got confetti, heart confetti. And then this one they gave out in Tagalog because it wasn't in English, but it said ikaw at akong Makaiba ngayoy bituwing iisa. Your girl's rich. Making it rain tips the money. So, with all that said and done, I am not gonna keep you anymore. Um, I'm going to show you a few clips from the concert. Here you go. Some clips from the tomorrow by together concert here in manila and this was i was fortunate enough to go on day two which was the last leg of their concert
and then I wore the hat. So alright, we're going to look for my car now and then I'll talk to you all about the concert when I get there. you have it everybody. Um, my Tomorrow by Together concert experience, it'll be something that I will remember and cherish forever. No, 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 comes home for an amazing concert experience like no other. So thank you so, 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 so much, everybody. And till the next concert, and till the next vlog.